guys, real quick, if you're a fan of country music, then check out this YouTube channel. If I wasn't a country singer, you know, I would probably uh, go back to my Chippendale days. Uh, if I wasn't a country artist, I was actually testing sewage before I got my riding deal. Those are two of country's biggest stars on the YouTube channel, Country Now. It's, it's got everything country related over there. They've got news, reviews, interviews, clips, and so much more. Click the link and check it out, and yeehaw, and howdy partner, and yella, and winda. I don't know, I don't know what I'm talking about. I got relatives in Kentucky. Bok, bok. <laughs> I don't know why I said bok, bok, but click the link. Mom! Helping moms, that's what I'm calling this video. Um, I could call it parents helping parents because <laughs> dads are welcome and so are people that aren't parents actually and kids. E everyone is welcome here is basically what I'm saying. But the reason why I'm calling it moms helping moms is because, well, I'm a mom. <laughs> moms. I love everything mommy related. Um, but I'm with a little community called Mom Pulse. They have a channel on YouTube. They are with full screen and um, I'm part of it. So I'm kind of bragging about it a little bit. And hey, if you make mommy related videos or want to make mommy related videos, you can actually find the link below. I'm going to call it um, Mom Pulse full screen down below and you can click on that. It'll take you to another dimension and you can apply to be a um, Mom Pulse member as well. And if not, that's okay. Just enjoy this video. Video, this video right here. Here, eat it, eat it. Yum. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why I told you to eat it. That was weird. I don't know what that was about, but anyway, my first initiative for Moms Helping Moms is going to be to help out a longtime subscriber of mine, Cami, who is such a doll. She has a son, Nick, who's 16, and he is amazing. He loves theater. He's a funny guy. He's just a great kid. As any mommy knows, their kid is the best at everything. At Everything. There is no cap and no limit to the amount of love you have for your child or children. So when Cami was faced with her son Nick's sudden deterioration, he had a seizure, he was speaking incoherently, the right side of his body went numb, um, and, and needless to say, when anything big or small goes wrong with your one of your babies, it is not easy to deal with. So I'm going to ask you guys to be supportive. This is part of my first Moms Helping Moms initiative, okay, and there's a link below called Caring Bridge. And and that is a link that Cami set up to help pay for hospital bills. And as someone who went from insured to uninsured and back and forth gosh, my whole lifetime, <laughs> I know that hospital bills are spendy. I can't afford to donate a lot, but I can afford to make a video and help spread the word. So if you're in the same penny pinching situation that I'm in, could you please consider that spreading this video or the video that is attached to this video in the description below. It's titled Nick and it's a video of Nick and his story and his progress. And um, if, if you could either spread one of these two videos around, uh, we would be really grateful. And if you have the means to donate and you click caring bridge and you go there and you donate to this family can I just say thank you a big fat huge thank you for doing that thank you and you know what I know that Nick and Cammie would love to hear your get well soon wishes so you can leave them on Nick's video and just let him know that you guys are rooting for him and pulling for him and you wish their family just the absolute best and my personal message to you Nick is that I hope you wake up every morning with that I'm going to kick this day's attitude. I think I can say ass because you're 16, but I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have said that. But listen, my point is, is that you are a bright, shining star. You are so talented, and no matter what happens to you, no matter how many hurdles you have to face and jump over to get to your goals and dreams and all of the accomplishments you want to make in this lifetime, you're going to get there, okay? Because you are a bright, shining star, and no matter what happens, you radiate, man, all right? So just have that attitude that, you know what, yeah, it might be full of suck right now but tomorrow is a new day and you just got to keep facing every single day with that attitude that you're going to conquer and rule the world and cammy you're such a doll you're nick your mom loves you so much she is amazing sauce okay and i hope nothing but the best for your entire family so everyone watching this video please send nick and his family some positive vibes and help spread the word please tweet it facebook it email it i mean i don't care how you do it or donate but if you can't donate then please help spread the word so it can get out to more people so there could be more potential to help this family out and, and thank you sincerely thank you for helping okay now I need some mommy help too okay I need help with my three-year-old Lulu who 
farts in public and screams out toot it is really funny and I love her and it's cute and it makes me laugh so hard every single time but here's what I'm really worried about if it was a little tiny three-year-old screaming out toots I think most of the adults and other kids would like look at that and laugh but Lulu who is three looks like a six-year-old so I feel like people are looking at me like oh your child is older so you should train that child a lot better and I don't know maybe maybe I'm just self-conscious about it but um, yeah she's gonna be starting school she's gonna be doing some classes this summer to help her catch up um, for pre-k and she I'm my biggest concern is that she's going to fart in class and be a disruption or have that bad habit run up rub off on another child and their parents are gonna be mad or the teacher is gonna look at the kid my, my little Lulu like she's like a little heathen or something so how can I get her besides from what I've already done to correct this action is just tell her don't don't say toots but the thing is I'm laughing every single time like she's never gonna take me seriously I tell her don't say toots but I am like crying because it's so funny but then everyone's giving me looks like you're you're a bad mom so here's the thing and all advice is welcome leave me your ideas leave me a comment below let me know what you think of this because I never had to deal with this with my older other two and Lulu thinks that farting is so funny right now that it's kind of like I really want her to enjoy it if that makes sense but I don't want it that behavior to be carried on when it's school time like I want to differentiate between fun time at home and things you don't do in public and things you don't do in school because we know every family has things you do that are not right to do in public but you do it in your own home and it's hilarious so give me some ideas give me some tips I could surely use that and p.s. I make homemade soap um, check it out this is my berry shea butter soap it smells really good it's purple and white and it smells it smells like grape and it's fabulous for your skin and I also make this one it's a berry it's a blueberry bar and it's orange pink and blue and you know what this is a great kids soap because it's fun for kids to use and it smells so good it smells like berries and then this soap is my newest soap it's vanilla raspberry bar I don't even know what I named it I had to read the label but it's um pink white and black and it's really really pretty and um, it smells oh my god you could almost eat this soap it smells so good but don't because you'll get sick Anyways, a shout out to me. I make homemade soap, holla, and I made this awesome circle scarf. So if you're interested, go to my Etsy shop. Oh my gosh, the link is below. So many links, so little time. Click on everything. Love you guys.